We are back at 747 and the Rose Bowl Parade is an iconic New Year's tradition and for the first time a local band. The band at Westchester University, their marching band is going to be in the parade. This is really cool. The entire band, of course, has been invited to perform out in Pasadena, California. PHL 17's Alex Butler joins us live with the band to talk about this exciting <laughs> invitation. Uh, Alex, they were they were really giving it to us before the break. Yes. Oh, my gosh. I want to know if they'll let me be in the band. Will you guys let me be in the band? Yeah. This is so cool because they are going to the Rose Parade. Let me tell you what, it is not an easy feat to get invited to this. It is a lot that goes into it. You got to be a really talented band. And when you see the Rose Parade in Pasadena, you're going to see these guys, Westchester University. So walk me through, what was it like for you guys, Adam, to get into this? You're the band director. This doesn't happen overnight. It certainly doesn't. It's a multi-year process. We submitted an application uh, actually back in 2020 um, for consideration. We have to send footage of us performing in parades, performing our field show. We need to give them history of the band. Um, um, tell them about what we do in the community, and then it's a highly competitive selection process that takes quite a long time. Yeah, and you guys are going to be there on New Year's Day. New Year's, we hope so. Yeah. Yes. yes, they were like, wait, uh, where's Hux going with this? Okay, so real quick, New Year's Day, choreographer, our man Todd, you put this all together, the directing of the beauty of all of this. So walk us through how, what are we seeing here? Yeah, so as soon as we got accepted, the first thing I said to myself, oh, we have to showcase the region because we have a campus one block from Independence Hall. Right. So I thought, why not try and pull the whole region together? So you see that we have a mural. It's going to come down the street. Here's one portion of it. Oh, with, oh way with, up high here. Yeah, this is rocky. So this is this one right there. There's 30 pieces so that make that up. So there are going to be 30 up. flags, essentially? Exactly. And they tell the whole story of our entire region. And then... First time ever for a university marching band, small push floats. So that's the love part that you see yep. there on, on the on the uh, actual poster yeah. board. This is a sample of it. Yeah, and it's all within the uh, parameters of what the Rose Parade floats do. So everything is natural material. These are cranberry seeds, parsley, um, split pea, and then also purple status. So cool. Yeah, so we have 28 total of those panels. Then once we get to LA, we have literally four days then to add all of the live florals that you see all in the drawing here. And then the cool part, the band will each have two red roses on their hats and it's called the Freedom Rose. So cool. So it ties in to our entire area. That is awesome. Okay, well, I want everybody to get a little sample of you. We're also going to have you perform in the next hour, but I want everybody to get a little sample of what they're going to see on New Year's Day because you guys definitely paid your dues. You're a killer band, and, of course, you're going to be rocking it come Pasadena New Year's Day. All right, so let's get a little sampling, and then I'll send it back to those guys back in the studio. But before, I'm going to be dancing back here pretending like I'm part of it. Okay, here we go. Ready? That's why Alex is there. They're going to rock that uh, Rose Bowl or the Rose Bowl parade out there. All right. Very cool. Thanks.